a little uh, toilet etiquette. The first thing is sitting on the stool, pot, whatever it is. Uh, and uh, you should have, a, right now I have a, what's this called, a gorilla thingy right there. So you prop your, your feet up as you sit back. Well, sit back, put your legs up. Because you should always uh, move your bowels in a uh, squatting position. Okay. So if you just have, have anything to put up there, right? Then the next thing I do is I uh, turn on the water. This is a uh, a little bit. I want to get the hot water going. You'll see in a second. Then you take your toilet paper. And here's what I like to do. Come on. That was toilet paper something. Huh? Okay. A lot of times people use a lot of toilet paper. You don't have to do that. Especially with these things that, well, unless you get those single, Scott single things like that. But uh, like these things are kind of cute. They get a little, they got a little wave there like that. Usually it's straight. Anyway, when you have a double ply, especially what you do is you uh, do like this. You, as you're sitting and pondering and doing your business, you could start playing with this. Oh, and you, the, the good quality you could do like this, like that. See? And then you sort of do it like that. You could still have your surface like that, but you have a little bit more, you know, the bone, whatever to it, okay? Now, I have the water going because I want to be hot. Because after you do your business, right? Now, if you don't have a water thing close, Unless you have a boudet, we're not doing that. Um, then you could even just spit a little bit on your thing, on the, on the, on the toilet paper. But what you do, is you just get a little, a little moist there, a little wet. And it's warm, so when you, well, okay, excuse me, when you rub yourself like that, you know, first thing you do, you rub it, right? Well, you know, you wipe yourself, as I say. Then you should actually look at what you're looking for blood and such, right? Okay, everything's cool. Then you put it in the thing like that. Okay, just so they gotta stand up. Oops. Okay. Now, the next thing you do, you really shut the water off. You really should look at your stool, right? You're looking for like parasites and just anything abnormal, right? Now, as you know, well, then you have the lid, right? So you, when you flush, you put the lid down when you flush because, and eh, they have the whole thing where, you know, bacteria comes up and blah, blah, blah. So you want to put the lid down. But here's the thing. When the women be complaining about, oh, they need to store the two up or whatever, whatever. Well, a lot of places don't have a lid. If you have a lid, you can put everything down and that's fine. There's a problem because I don't know how they came up with that thing, but you actually, I think the lid should be every lid, right? Then you have the, um, I guess the stool itself, whatever, whatever you want to call it. And then you have the bowl. A lot of places, a lot of places I've been in, in the other, in the third, well, I'm third, but in other places, they don't have a bowl. Or well, like, you know, other places they don't have a bowl, right? I think you should have everything up, leave the bowl up so when men come, they can, go, they can just do the bowl because men are lazy, you know. If you leave this, if you leave the seat down, they're going to, they're going to, you know, urinate all over the seat. So it don't make any sense. They say, then they should put it down. Don't freak at them, you know. Leave everything up. If the woman, the, the, the woman do some work, well, you, it's like that. Then you can put your seat down. And if it's dirty, you clean it off, you see, like that. So. The, 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 the thing is, if you don't have a lid, well, you have a lid, I guess you put everything down, but then you still run the risk of a man just pulling up, <laughs> taking still, you know, urinating all over the seat. So the best thing, women, is leave everything up. So the man comes, because they're men lazy. They do their thing, da 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 and then everybody's happy. Okay? So there you go. Some uh, toilet etiquette from me, T, from the past, and taking the trenches to bed, letting you know what I only suspect.